I'm just trying to prove that I'm positive, outgoing. I want to be a leader and show people the right way to do things in life, not only baseball. It's persistent, uh, just the tenacity that he's, he's working at and the pace that he's striving to get to. He's just eager to learn. My name is Casey Hintz, I'm 16 and I play baseball. To describe Casey, I think that he's the guy that you always want on your team. You know, he's, he's, he's accountable to the discipline that he has on and off the field. Defensively, I think that there aren't too many shortstops in the state, let alone Midwest. Just his hands, um, really fast and fluid and smooth, a two-step release which I think he gets, he kind of gets the ball out of his glove um, quicker than a lot of high school guys that I've seen. We're gonna go two hand straight at you, catch, forehand, backhand, and then switch your feet, backhand. So just working some hip mobility um, right off the bat. So what we want to do is make sure that kind of our hips are, are rotating and making sure that we get them as far or as close as we can to the ground and then rotate through. All right, control the middle of your body. This is the first year that we've been kind of actively um, working together and also coming up with different programs from his strength and conditioning to um, sprint work, his mobility, hitting, fielding. He's always asking questions about, you know, how can he get better? That's the type of player he is and he just works hard. A lot of times, especially for well, athletes in general, but just the hip mobility, being able to just open that up and, and prep the kind of day, that way we can really maximize what we, our bodies can do. I play for the Illinois Indians. I'm on their 17 slash 18 team. For high school ball, I started on varsity as a freshman, and I'm just getting better every day to be the best player I can. It's really fun. I'm always learning something new every day. Every day there's something new that I need to work on. So first one we'll do, just to kind of go off of what we are doing outside of the cage and in the weight room. Um, first one, let's just get our rhythm. I'm just going heel to heel, just to feel that rhythm in our feet. I always saw myself as a leader and like teaching other people what to do, showing them where they should be on the field. I just thought it was important to be that person on the team that shows them what they're supposed to do. I think his speed really plays a big factor. Um, just being able to lay out singles and the doubles, increasing kind of the bunt game to bring everybody in, and then he can really maximize kind of what he can do at the plate. Um, and that's what we're working on, you know, and that's, that's why he's, he's continually doing that day in, day out, just to be consistent with what he's doing. Um, so this one's one incorporating rhythm and timing in his feet, um, as well as kind of a, a cue for him of what pace he's working at. That way, it's one where he's under that control and stability type movement that, that we like to see. He plays at a really, really fast pace, and that's something that I do like, and he, he brings it. So kind of his speed, his hands, and then from there, I think uh, overall, his arm. I mean, that's kind of the last, last piece that he's, he really brings to the table. Good right there, Case. Good. One more. Good. Um, so from there, we'll transition. Um, from our hips, we like to start from the ground up. And then once we do kind of have that hip mobility and just prep through it, um, we'll start to incorporate how we'll get into the ground as well as how we're disassociating. The med ball works on being explosive through the ball. Two years ago was when I really started focusing on it and starting to weight lift and get bigger so I can be more competitive. You know, I don't, I don't know if you could put a tag on what his kind of work ethic is. It's, it's one of his own, but it's also one where you get everything, everything that he has, which is 
all you can ask for. Yeah, and then we can have a little bit of rhythm. I started playing baseball when I was like two or three years old. And I would just play out in the front yard with my brother and my dad. It wasn't specifically with the baseball, we'd do the tennis ball, play with football, just anything that involved the game of baseball. Uh, I always liked pitching, and then over the years, like, I like shortstop more and second base just because I got to be like a leader on the field and got a lot more action. It's really fun being able to compete against others, being able to outwork people and prove people wrong, uh, show others my like real character and that I'm hardworking and competitive. Uh, love watching it, just learning more about the game every day.